Galileo, Galileo was punished because he said, Earth is moving around the sun. What I have done over a period of years, and you all hearing the big heart transplantation, what I have done, and contribution to the medical sciences. I was the first one. I was, I was the only one in India where I was allowed to use the zirconia. However, now, what I have learned in the medical school, what I was taught within the medical books are wrong by 80%, if not 100%, but in case of, but in case of 1978, in Belfast, Royal Victoria Hospital, I have performed more than 8,000 bypass surgery, but they were all wrong. It is not that I did wrong thing, it is a procedure, genetically it is wrong. And it is detrimental to the health and health of Today's medical sciences is fail to treat or fail to cure any disease like Takayasu, like SLE and many others, which genetic engineering or Perfect name would be Applied Human Genetic Engineering. It's qualified, not even got a certificate. The, the PRCA will be here. I was thinking there's something beyond what we don't know. And then cardiac surgery, then still I have seen that we didn't do very much. So therefore, conventional treatment will not help you. And come back to the investigations of the cardiovascular diseases and what we were doing the ECG, echocardiography, and the when it is done, already it is made. It has to be at a molecular level. Investigation has to be at molecular level, which I laid down in the book. All the experimentations that I have conducted or carried out by myself and my assistants, Dr. Gita Osweger, who is with me last 20 years. She did PhD in biochemistry 20 years ago in Bhava Atomic Research Center, an excellent scientist. Without her, it was impossible for me to carry out the, all these experimentations in the field of applied human genetic engineering. Now, perhaps the, this book is giving you the two chapters. First chapter, is a foundation and to build a building you need and see that natural calamity like earthquake, natural calamity like a storm cannot break it and what we did is and you see in the book who does it? Who criticizes who? I have observed this for the last many years. The brainless people always criticize the brainy people. But in return, brainy people never criticize them because Brainless people are not comparable, not comparable. That's why later on, there is a, two things I want to say. One is declaration, one is announcement. Declaration I declare is, two thousand come, you must, have, you must accept it. Otherwise you have got a two roads. One road to your grave prematurely. One road to applied human genetics, you must accept it. Otherwise you have nothing. Secondly, I want to make a public announcement. From 15th of January of 2009, myself and Dr. Asreka will be busy in experimentation and on human, total human genomic mapping. I, I call it is total human genomic horoscope. What will give you what you were genetically what you are genetic and what you are going to be, what diseases you are going to have it, and how we correct it, we'll tell you. And I'll make the book with the hope that it will revolutionize medical sciences.
phenomena which are not really explained. And we call them as mystery. But these are questions regarding some genetic disease and a solution for the same. When we talk about genetics, most of us know that the subject started with the classical work of Gregor Mendel based on his experiments